Subsection 3 of Reclaiming Revolution History, Summation, and Lessons from the Work of Storm Standing Together to Organize a Revolutionary Movement This recording is in the public domain. Recorded by The Progressing America Project Theory Development Work Group Among the most pressing challenges for each Marxist generation, and Storm is no exception, is the need to articulate from each unique historical conjuncture, the revolutionary unity of theory and practic. It is up to us to articulate the generational and historical answers that will make Marxism viable. From the proposal to form a theory development workgroup. Storm established the theory development workgroup to advance and articulate our political line. This workgroup identified Storm's theoretical strengths as our ability to name the major limitations of traditional Marxism-Leninism such as its poor racial and gender analysis and its failed practice in true democracy, and to draw on the histories of liberation movements. Theory development also identified Storm's weaknesses. Our knowledge of historical Marxist texts and recent critiques of Marxism was shallow. We tended not to engage critically enough with Marxist theory. In response, Theory Development proposed that we engage in deeper study to help us to develop as well-trained Marxists. We would then be able to engage critically with Marxism and push Marxist theory and practice to the next level. But the work group hit a rough spot in 1998 when Storm's most theoretically developed member left the organization. Following this member's departure, Theory Development felt unable to continue with its proposed work plan. The workgroup developed an alternative plan. It would document the history of the revolutionary internationalist trend in the Bay Area. After several months of work, theory development decided that the project was too large in scope and could not complete it. The members of the workgroup concluded that they did not have the capacity to make the workgroup an effective wing of the organization. They proposed that the workgroup temporarily disband and that the Corps spend six months studying to 1. Deepen its grasp of revolutionary Marxism. 2. Identify the areas of theory that the theory development workgroup should explore. And 3. Identify steps for rebuilding the workgroup. The general membership disbanded theory development in early 2000, despite some anxiety about the potential negative impact on the theoretical development of the organization. Storm never reconstituted this workgroup. End of subsection 3